All right, so rounding up the show today is Kent Angry Man Christmas. Kent's a very angry prophet, and I'm very much glad that this guy wasn't my dad growing up. Kind of scary. But this is a video. Actually, I think this is a repost on another channel, but um, this is a video. It's been out a couple of days, and he's giving a prophecy here, and he really heads out into the stratosphere on this one. As he over the top gets emotional with some pretty good acting skills. So we're going to listen to the first clip here so you can get a feel for well, maybe an Academy Award winning performance. But uh, let's give it a listen. I have. Um, I've touched something in the spirit. And I believe that God is going to release something today by the Holy Ghost into the atmosphere and the Lord says that I am opening the heavens. <laughs> Those of you that are listening to me right now, you just begin to release your prayer language. I'm telling you right now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is, God says there's a repositioning. Oh, my God, I see it. The Lord is... The hand of God is reaching down wherever you are right now, whether you're in your living room, your car, I don't know, but I'm telling you by the Spirit of the Lord that God says that there is an open heaven and it's almost like there's a rapture in the spirit realm, not not and not in the natural, but there is God is is taking a hold of your spirits right now. And, and the Lord says that there has been uh Many of you have been set free from from things, harassments, de demon spirits, habits. All right, so that was a pretty good performance, right? And by golly, it's just so coincidental that the camera was rolling. And right when the camera started rolling, he looked up into the spirit and, oh, my God, I see the spirit or whatever he said. And, and he was, you know, touched something in the spirit and, and the camera caught everything. So he was able to make a video. So lucky us. But I'm just looking at him right now. <laughs> he's, got his, he's got his fist clenched. He wants to just reach out and crack you. He wants to punch you because he's an angry man. I don't think he likes humans. But either way, uh, I noticed a pattern as I listened to the rest of it. And so... I kind of cut and snipped and put this pattern together. I'm going to play it for you right now. See if you can identify it. And uh, I'll also kind of consider this a challenge because it's kind of hard to hear, but also kind of funny. So give it a listen. Release. Haya bobo sandaya. The brain. Haya bobo sandai. Yaya bobo bo sandai. Even as mins. Yara bobo bo sandai. Hara bobo bo kotoria sandaya. Yaria sita la bobo bo kotsandaya. Oria kita la bobo bo 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 soria sandai. Creation. Kara bobo bo sandai. It's a. Haya bobo bo Sunday. Yaya bobo shatarias harias satala bobo bo satala baba baka Sunday. Hiya ria kita la bobo bo kotoria Sunday. Ya bobo bo Sunday. So yeah, I'm not sure who Bobo is, and it sounds like he wants to see him on Sunday. I could be wrong, but he said it several times. So I'm thinking that uh, he really needs to see Bobo on Sunday. Either way, uh, maybe you disagree. Maybe maybe it's real tongues. Maybe that's a real language, right? Uh, in any case, all right, so I pounded that into the ground. Uh, Ken Christmas, ladies and gentlemen, just wanted to include that. Uh, a confirmed false prophet and a master manipulator. Stay away from him in Jesus Christ's name. All right, folks, so that's going to wrap it up for this week's episode of Friday Fruit Clips. And, you know, that last clip with uh, Ken Christmas kind of reminded me of something. So I thought we'd close out the show with that old tribute to Robert Tilton. See if you guys remember this and see if the tongues, the so-called tongues, kind of sound familiar. Here we go. Watch this.
Hallelujah. Right here. 